As you all know, the Super Bowl was this uh, last Sunday. Well, Christina Aguilera sang the, uh, the national anthem for the Super Bowl this year, and she did really bad. Like, worst of all, worseness. It was just horrible. Oh, this is gonna be the best one. She sings the best out of all those. And she totally just ruins it. Whose broad stripes and bright stars through the what so proudly we watched at the twilight last dreaming. So she messed up on the national anthem. Whatever. Get over it. You know she knows the song. She sang it before. But I mean, the Super Bowl is a big thing. Big event. I think I think I would make a mistake. I think anybody would make a mistake. So give her a break. One thing I do want to say about this video, look very closely. What are you doing? Trying to be like Cindy Lauper? <laughs> Come on, there's better people to try and imitate. That leads us to our next video. I personally think it was one of the best halftime shows that the Super Bowl's ever had in the past 10 years. Best thing. Worst thing was, Fergie tried to sing like Axl Rose, and she can't do it, and everyone knows it now. Don't try that again. If I was one of those people getting recorded, I couldn't help but laugh. Fergie is a good artist, but she can't sing like Axl Rose. I don't think anyone can, except for Axl Rose. I'll give her that in the future. Don't ever try that again. Anybody, just putting that out there. But overall, halftime show was really good. Little Wayne decided to come out with a green and yellow song. Horrible. It is just horrible. You can't even understand what he's saying. And then at one point he says he's gonna toast somebody. Pop-Tarts. What that even means, no one knows. Now, here is a real Packers fan. This kid came up with his own song, green and yellow also. But he's actually talking about the team and not Pop-Tarts. Here's the clip. On my head, on the hoodie, on the field is green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow. Kings of the grid, I show you what the real is. Green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow. The infamous team in the end zone every game. Green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow. We play ball, we belong in the Hall of Fame. Green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow, green and yellow. See, now that's a true Packers fan. Someone who actually sings about the game. This kid shows up Lil Wayne. Now Lil Wayne's just a wannabe. Lil Wayne, I like most of your music, but this song, it just sucks. Ha ha, little kid showed you up. This right here is my pretty boy swag. Pretty boy swag. On the comments section below, tell us what Packers video you like best. And what was the biggest fail of the Super Bowl? Bergie singing like Axel? Christina singing like Sydney, or Ben Roethlisberger throwing away the game. I mean that running back was wild. <laughs>